Hi right, again. Welcome back to my channel. This is Chris Hunter with part two of the review of Marvel Studios The First Ten Years three pack box set for Iron Man 3. Here we'll be taking a look at the Mandarin. At first, I thought this would kind of be my least favorite figure of the box set. And even though after getting into him, he's actually a really good figure. The detail, especially on his face, really surprised me. I mean, this is just nice detail all around. Let's look at the cape. Or his cloak, whatever you want to call it. The, it's embroidered. It's the gold. Nice paint apps. Gold trim, a little design right here. A little bit of paint mist right here where you see, see the skin tone, but that's easily fixable, it's not too noticeable. Patterning right here it goes across the belt. There's army color. Boots, no paint, on, no paint app on the boots, but it's still nice and detailed. Pegos in the feet, the bottom of the feet are detailed. So, let's see his articulation. So I can move up a bit. He can look up a little bit. Of course, with his beard, he can't really look down at all. Head moves, you know, all the way around. Arms go up about this much. Then the cloak hinders the articulation a little bit. Just then go fully around each side. Double jointed elbows. No, actually, oh, I state that. He doesn't have a double joint elbows, he only has a single joint. But he can go in about mm, almost 90 degrees. This wrist can turn, but because of the scope, you really don't get much movement out of the, the wrist. Really, so there is a, I think there's a hinge. I can't tell if there's a hinge or if it's just a ball joint. It does have all his rings? You know, they give him a trigger finger on this hand, but he comes with no gun. The rings again, you can see here. Again, the wrist, I can get this one to go all the way around. But that's all you can really do with his hands. So, same here, single elbow joint on this one. Seems to go either at perfect 90, or this one doesn't. Yeah, almost 90. Slightly more 90. Okay, let's see. There's no ab crunch. Got waist swivel all the way around. Legs go out about that far. Swivel right there at the hips. On each side. Does have double jointed knees, so that's good. Right there. And Right there, double jointed the knees. He can kick out about that far. So, oh, probably 90. Can go back just a little bit. And he's got. Anchors move up and down. There's no swivel here. So anchors move up and down. Got does he have an angle pivot? Yep, he's got angle pivot. A 
so when you stand them up, it stands very well. But it's mostly the cloak that's holding my hair down the bottom. He stands very well. But, like I was saying, let's get a really good close look at that face. And look at that. I think that's one of Hasbro's best. Even the paint and the beard. His wrinkles. That's a nice looking face. And you may not have been the real Mandarin, but it makes a good looking figure. Should we call him Trevor? Oh, not too bad if I have to say so. I like him. Overall, I really do like this set. Each each of these figures have, have their pluses, and I actually like them all, so I highly recommend this set. Very nice. Chris Hunter, 100% approves. Have a great day, and thanks for watching.